Hey, what's going on people? Tech Jamo. So just a little quick video today. We're out here with this Wi-Fi 6 USB adapter from the guys at D-Link. Big shout out to them for sending me this down to have a little review. So as I said, quick video, let's get it unboxed, get it plugged in and see if it's actually on job. So we got the Wi-Fi 6 USB adapter here to connect your laptop to a Wi-Fi 6 router. Uh, USB 3.0, superior range, AX1800 speeds and Mu Mimo technology, whatever that means. Um, <laughs> yeah, got a couple of bits of writing on the box there, but we're not actually interested in that. We're, we're more interested in what's going on inside. So let's fight with this adhesive tape okay let's have a look and see what we've got going on here ah so this is the wi-fi 6 adapter it looks pretty cool actually um don't have any d-link branding on it as far as i can see let's take off that little thing there hey you got a little usb-c port right there um, and this is just a little hood. I think you've got a little LED here as well, which is kind of cool. Ah, there's the D-Link branding. I know there was going to have to be some D-Link branding on here. Can you guys see that? Little D-Link branding there. Yeah, yeah. We love to see it. And that's about it, really. That's about it. Let's get it plugged in and see what the Wi-Fi speeds are saying. All right, now let's get testing, guys. Now I'm going to try and make this as simple as possible. My current broadband provider is called Zen Broadband or Zen Internet, and they are promising 900 megabytes download speed with 120 megabytes of upload speed. And I've got that all running through my D-Link gaming router. I'll put the link to where you can get that router in the description section below. I also put the link to the video I made of that router. Um, and funny enough, most of the devices in my house are already Wi-Fi 6 compatible or have Wi-Fi 6 chips in them, except for this little Huawei laptop we've got here. So what I'm gonna do is just use the Wi-Fi that's built in on this Huawei, see what speeds we get, and then I'm gonna plug this Wi-Fi 6 adapter into the Huawei and see what speeds we get then. And we'll try it in a room where we're obviously right next to the router and we'll try it in a room where we're also further away from the router. So these are the speeds that we're getting with the built-in Wi-Fi chip that just comes with the laptop kind of thing. I'm not sure what chip it is. I think we can find that out though, can't we? Can we go into that? Can we find it out? I'll just put it in the description section below somewhere so I don't like give some mad details out. I don't know. <laughs> So what I'm going to do now, because this laptop doesn't have any full-size USB-A slots, um, I'm going to use this little adapter, simply plug the Wi-Fi 6 router or adapter thing into the little USB-C dock. Um, I'm going to wait for it to come up here. It should come up as like a second Wi-Fi, ah, there we go, Wi-Fi 2. So what I'm going to do, let me just turn off the Wi-Fi 1 chip. And we're going to go to Wi-Fi 2 and we're going to turn this chip on. And there we go. Got my network here. Let me just put in the password real quick. There we go. That should be connected. Right. So connected to the same network, but we're using this little router now. And you can kind of see that it's lit up blue there to show that it's on and it's working. Um, and now we're going to go back to here and go to test and let's see what speeds we get. Wow. <laughs> wow. Literally 10 times the speed in the same position just because it's going through this little Wi-Fi adapter now. Wow. Wow, look at that. That is wild. <laughs> that is wild. I don't even think I need to go to another room. I don't think I need to go to another room, but I'm gonna to go to another room just for you guys. Right, okay. Let's take this to a room at the end of the house. There we go. Mind the mess, guys, mind the mess. Okay. We're in a completely different room down the hallway now. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna plug out this little Wi-Fi stick, a little Wi-Fi 6 adapter. 
And I'm literally doing this all handheld in the bushiest way possible. Now, I think the standard Wi-Fi should just, yep, that's all connected now, as you can see there. So let's see what the internet connection speed is saying from across the room. Okay, Fuft, oof. 18 megabytes, 19 megabytes is struggling. It's struggling. Let's see what the upload is. Oh, upload is looking roughly the same still. Roughly the same. Now, as I promised, we're gonna plug in the USB-C dock, which has, wait, where the hell is the plug from? The hell? Okay, we're in. <laughs> we're in, the little blue light isn't on yet though. Can we get the, ah, there we go, we're getting connected. So what I'm gonna do, let me go to the Wi-Fi again. Okay, Wi-Fi 2 is now connected. And let's see how fast this Wi-Fi chip is um, from across the hallway. Let's see what we've got going on here. Wow, the speeds are still dope. Look at those speeds, guys. Guys, that's not a joke thing, you know? That is not a joke thing. Look at those speeds. Wow. Wow. So the speeds that I'm getting, and bear in mind, I am a couple rooms away now. The speeds that I'm getting are almost basically the same as it were when I was right next to my router. Guys, does, does this video need a summary? You saw 20 megabytes when this was not plugged in. 200 megabytes when I plugged this in. The end. D-Link, you're the plug. Links in the description section below. I'll catch you guys in the next one.